Welcome to a demonstration of Alteryx Analytics. This video will demonstrate how to blend data from different data sources and perform some aggregation on the data for further analytical purposes. In this example, we will merge customer data with transaction data to create a view of the customer in terms of total number of purchases and total spend. The Alteryx designer gives analysts the ability to independently access the data they need and create an analytic data set through an intuitive workflow environment. We can simply drag and drop an input tool to the canvas to access data of virtually any type from any source. In this case, we are bringing in a file of our customers. Once we bring the file in, we can gain insight into the data through the properties box on the left or at any point in the process by dragging in a browse tool. You'll notice that this file contains a unique customer ID, a store number, the name of the customer, as well as their address and location. The next thing we want to do is bring in some transaction data. We go through the same process by dragging the input tool to the canvas and bringing in the file. This file contains that same unique customer ID, product names, as well as sales and order numbers. Looking at this file, we realize that the transaction data is an XML file so all of the fields will be read as text. Therefore, we want to do some preparation and transformations on this data. First, we bring in a select tool to reformat the data. We are changing the data types of sales to a numeric double. The next step is to transform and aggregate this data. By bringing in a summarize tool, we can begin to group by customer ID, summarize total purchases in dollars, and then count the total number of transactions each customer has made. Now we're ready to blend these two files together. The Alteryx Designer contains several tools to help with data blending. Here we will use a join tool to merge the data streams based on a common field. In this case it will be customer ID. We now drop in a browse tool and run the module to get the final combined data set. From here, we can continue to build out an advanced analytic workflow or simply output this data to a file, a relational database, or even a visualization tool like Tableau.